So I woke up this morning and I'm currently 197 pounds. I went from a clean 185 to what you are seeing now. And I'm tired of it. And if you're wondering how my body has changed that quickly, I'm not gonna say quickly, it was June 1st. That's like when I, I'm not gonna say fall off, but like, you know, I took a step back a little bit. Um, let's see. So it's been about eight months since, you know, I last had abs, since my body fat percentage was low, I think below 10. And that was me eating the caloric deficit. That was me training like four, three, four times a, a week. So I can confidently say I was at the best shape of my life at that time. So since then I gained about, you know, 20 pounds. Uh, technically it's 12, but I'm just going to round it up to 20, gained about 20 pounds. So now it's time to get back on it time to get back on the train. So I'll be showing you guys how I'm gonna do it. For the next month, I'm gonna be eating below 1500 calories every single day. So the goal is to record what I eat every single day and then post it the next day so you guys can actually see. And I'm gonna call it a challenge because it is a challenge. It's not easy eating in a caloric deficit. If you really wanna cut weight, it's in your best interest to be as consistent as possible when it comes to your diet. That's like 90% of it. You gotta have low calories going in. You gotta increase the protein intake. I highly encourage you to eat three to four times a day, even five. I'll be showing you guys everything I'm eating. I'm gonna be showing you guys what I eat in a day throughout the next month. Stay tuned, make sure you're subscribed. Maybe you can get some inspiration on some of the foods to eat while you're going through a caloric deficit. My fridge is empty, empty as hell. I'm gonna be going to Costco. I'm gonna load this bad boy up for the entire month of March. Everything I get me needs to lash me till then. If I have to buy some more, I'll buy some more, I'll do whatever it takes. Let's go to Costco. One of the main reasons why I like going to Costco is because you can get the chicken and the salmon in bulk. So it'll last you a very long time. So now we're gonna head to Walmart to get the rest of the stuff. Walmart has got to be one of my favorite places to shop at. One of my favorite things are the prices on the veggies. They're a dollar each. So I stacked up on them and I also got a few other things. So this is everything that I'm gonna be consuming for this month. I'm gonna be very, very strict. I'm gonna show you guys different recipes on how I you know, make it interesting so it's not boring. I remember the first time when I was overweight and I was going through the weight loss. I'm not gonna lie, if you go through my old videos, the food was kind of boring. I wasn't eating for taste, I was just eating for results. And that makes it harder if dieting for you is like the, the your biggest problem, because you know it has to taste good. Now, I've been finding new ways to make eating healthy, cutting weight easier, where the food tastes good, but it also has high nutrition facts, which will benefit you if you're trying to lose weight. So, this is what I have. Um, I got two bags of chicken and I got a bag of salmon that could last me probably three months. And then I got my Premier Protein. If you haven't checked that video out, please do. I just do a, a nice review on all the flavors that they have. And I got my yogurt here. I got these protein chips. I'm gonna be doing something nice with these. So make sure you guys stay tuned for this month so you guys can see um, how I implement that into my diet. Then I got the thin Oreos down there. I got these gummies. I'm a gummy fanatic, so I figured I'd eat this before a workout. I could use the sugar for the energy. I got my salads. And then I got an almond flour, uh, almond flour wraps. The nutrition facts on these are good, so I went with those. The rest of the veggies are in the fridge, in the freezer, actually. This is everything I got so far. So this looks a lot better. When you guys go shopping, make sure you bring a list, because I think I forgot something. I definitely forgot some eggs, and I think I forgot some other things too. Stay tuned for this month. I'll be throwing these videos out left and right. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's gonna be an exciting month. The goal is to push out 31 videos for the month of March, right? That's a video every day. The goal is to get back, all right, I'm 197. I could probably lose 10 pounds. So the goal is to get to 187 by the end of March. And I think, you know, if I'm consistent enough, especially consistent with the diet, I believe I could hit 187. So let's see, I don't know if I'll get the abs back it all depends on the body fat but let's see what we can do other than that make sure you guys subscribe hit that like button and thanks for supporting your boy as always other than that we are out my jumper is water bad give me one more got a clean rep give me one more got a prezi jet mount rush more one more set need one